Oof Clan, I am officially recording this video on my birthday. I'm 23! I'm getting old! 23! But well, I don't feel any different, guys, at all. <laughs> Something's wrong here. I'm regenerating! Oh, guys, thank you so much for the support for the four years on the channel. I love you all so much, but it's time for me to go. It's over, guys. I'm regenerating. I don't want to go. <laughs> Same hair? Same hands? Same big nose? Acne? Ugly teeth? It's me? It's me? Hey? I think the oofs saved me. After countless <coughs> sacrifices of oofs, they still saved me. Maybe it was my job to kill the oofs for eternity, and that's why I can never look back or ever change. Wow. This turned really deep. How do you like the uh, jumper, by the way? It's in my merch store, and I think it looks pretty cute. But welcome back to Day Shift at Freddy's, guys. If you remember last episode, uh, we did the really, really bad ending, and the creator, Doggo, told me that is the baddest, evilest ending you can get in the game, where we killed Dave, even though I was totally not expecting that to happen, and then we um, got Henry in our brains. Um, and that was the end of it, and then the game crashed, so yeah, really dark ending. And we learned some things from it as well, though, so it was definitely a really cool ending. As promised, guys, we are gonna go back and do the good ending, where we're going to say no to Dave, uh, when he offers us to, uh, kill a kid with him. We're just gonna say no. Because we are now the Oof Lord, guys, we've got the powers to go back in time and revert everything that we did. So we're back here at the pizzeria, like nothing happened uh, in the few episodes we did. Uh, double uploads recently, guys, with this game. <laughs> we have got a lot of money, boys, and I think, guys, what we're gonna do is buy different things that we didn't buy before, so you can see them uh, when we do it. So let's have a look at the room upgrades again. Um, let's renovate the dining area. I think. Let's get the deluxe one and see what that looks like. Mwah. Amazing. And then uh, we, we can upgrade a room, right? We can get a room if I... Uh, extra room. Here we go. What can we get? A prize court. A strip club. Guys, it's my birthday. Let's get it! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I hope you realise that's what we're gonna have to hire a costume stripper, right? That'll be an uncomfortable job listing coming from a restaurant designed for kids. Well, get hiring then. I hate you. Poppycock, it's, it's stripper fox time. Hey, Dios mio. Okay, what's in here? As expected, it's a stripping room. With the very old stripper fox there. Stripper Foxy. Okay, I think we're done for today, guys. Let's go straight to the pizzeria and say no to uh, Dave um, because he offers us to kill a kid. We're just going to say no and see what happens. One month later, boys. Let's go. Let's see if Bear is lovely and sparkly and not boarded up with police. It's fine. See? The oof powers worked. Here we are, we're back at your very own Freddy Fazbender's Pizzeria joints. Fred Bear appears to be having fun above your door. It's the last day of this month, so you better check up on how phone is getting on. Um, so we've been through this, guys. Um, phone guy will not know that we did all that bad stuff. Surprise me, please. Lovely. Da -da 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 -da. Oh. Oh. Yeah, this is happy music. Okay, hello, phone guy. Um, we're gonna skip all this, guys. 
um, because you've seen it all before and I don't want to waste your time. Okay, guys, so the health inspector's coming today and phone guy tells us to instantly go into the safe room and then Dave appears. Why, hello there. Oh, Hi Dave, I've missed you. Sorry about killing you last episode. That wasn't me. That was Henry, I promise. I was not expecting that. I honestly swear that was not me. Okay? He doesn't know that happens though. Thanks. Yeah, I hope you're proud. I did that for you. To say sorry. <laughs> and it's my birthday. <laughs> <laughs> I did. And the choosing the salvage me, the best choice of all. Um, the reason why I'm at this point, guys, is because apparently, if you salvage him or not salvage him, he'll still come into the pizzeria at, that, at this specific point anyway. Um, the, the 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 cross point is when you say no or yes to killing the toddler. I know. Like I know exactly like before. I know, but we, we can't do it. Any Sorry, Dave. Sportsy, I promise you, stick with me. No, it's over, I Dave. You, a star. I can give you, a life. you This doesn't work, Dave. You, you you are still unhappy when you kill this kid. This isn't going to work again. We are going to help you the good way. I can make good on. Please don't me I'm sorry, Dave. I'm sorry. Get out of my restaurant, Dave. Sportsy, you don't. Oh, well, let me tell you. Uh, you have no fucking clue what you've just done. He's not happy. So, you salvage me, and as soon as I'm back, you decide to fuck me out onto the curb. Well, I was going to salvage you. We was going to have fun, but then you just go into your old ways and try and kill kids again. Sportsy, honey. Sorry. Do you really think I'm going to give it? I hope you do because we're gonna we're gonna beat your freaking booty, Dave. Whether you try hard or not, it would be easier for you if you didn't try. Because I'm gonna win whether you like it or not, mate. Then I will let this go. Mark my fucking word, old boy. Bring it on. We are a family. We are. And family doesn't give up on family. True. A kid is gonna go missing here, old boy. If that happens. And so be it. Word, you are gonna learn what it means to lose something, the idiot. I will come back, old boy. I always do. I know you do, Dave. Goodbye, old fuck. Did he just call me that? He didn't call me old sport anymore. That means he's definitely not happy, guys. He is not happy. Oh well. Bye, Dave. Nice knowing you. Plus, so this is completely new story now, guys. Completely new. So no more skipping. Let's just go for it. Boss, there you are. The inspector's here. I managed to buy us as much time as possible, but you know, the more time we spend in the dining area, the greater chance he has on spotting the scuttlers. The infestation. He's waiting out there, sir. You should go out and grease the old wheels, you know. Put on your soulless orange charm. Good luck, sir. Thanks, phone guy. Oh, you're not saying the health inspector. Hello, Mr. Inspector. Hello, I am the health inspector. He's, oh, Fre he's French. You are the owner, correct? Oui. I am the owner. It is a pleasure to... To... Hold on. Uh -oh. That face, I know it. Okay. My father once showed me a photograph of you and him together. Oh, okay. Do you remember this? Um. You look exactly like him. <laughs> he said you were awful. <laughs> and you made him explode. Uh, sorry about that. I... It's nice to meet you too. You look a lot like your father, you know. Well, then let us begin the LC inspection. Okay. Yes, well. This is the dining area. 
Yes, I've seen nothing but this room for the last 10 minutes. And everything's fine. No problems at all. What was that? Um, it totally wasn't the scuttlers carrying a Dorito bag across the room. Please don't shoot me down. Elf violation. Bring me to the next room, please. Okay. <laughs> He's not happy, is he, boys? This is the hallway. It's very exciting. Are you stalling for time? Uh, no. Is it a yes? Yes. I would like to see the toilets. <gasps> you, you don't want to go in there. You don't want to go in there. Trust me. Sure thing, boss. Right this way. Oh God. The I hope the pelicans are not there still. Okay, we're fine. Behold, toilets. These toilets don't look awfully clean. Then again, you should have seen the last Freddy's location that my father surveyed. Ah, oh, okay. Some insane person blew up a urinal. That wasn't me. Uh, nervous sweating. Uh, really? Imagine that. Let's move on. Ha. <laughs> um. Oh, we could stall. Fine, right this way, sir. Okay. Where are we going to go now? <laughs> what do you want me to say, guys? How am I supposed to explain this? This is my Foxy-themed strip club. Don't say it. Thanks. I did it. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Health and Supplementary Elbow. Want to inspect my butt? The stripping foxy is called Oscar. I swear to God, he doesn't work here, Mr. Inspector. So, you let dangerous perverted furries just roam your restaurant freely? Uh, would it be better if I said that he does work here? So, you employ dangerous perverted fairies. Elf hazard. Uh oh. And I've dug myself into a hole. Please, Mr. Inspector. <laughs> Thanks, Oscar. Uh, we're not going to fire Oscar. Let's just leave the room. It's not Oscar's fault. <laughs> This is the office! My office! Look! A camera monitor! Okay, the tour's over. Look, I'll be honest. It's amazing that the roof hasn't caved in yet. With the amount of rats, mold and asbestos above us. This place is dangerous. Uh... Every second we're here, our combined life expectancy falls by at least three minutes. Ah! I'm going to have to shut this place down. No! Like, right now. No! Um. No way, Mr. Mr. Inspector. You don't want to do that. Why not? Um. I'll I'll give you. T well, is there anything I can do for you? Well, it is my son's birthday next month. <gasps> if you host this party here free of charge, I'll let you guys off the hook. But. You said this place was full of mold and rat turds. Why would you want to bring your child here? Eh, hey, I said I was a parent, not a good parent. <laughs> oh, no, no. <laughs> okay, fine, fine, we have a deal, you baguette. Okay, enough. I will see you later, deranged orange man. Bye! Well, that worked. That worked perfectly. <laughs> Sir, it's me, the phone! Your favorite phone! Uh, do you have to enter like that? I, uh. Ah, uh, forget it! I just saw the inspector walk out! I take everything went fine then! Well, I sorta of had to bribe him, but otherwise.
Groovy! So, what did he demand? Money? Booty? <laughs> we have to host his son's birthday party next month. Why, that's... We can do that! After all, we throw parties all the time! We can do this! We... Dear God, we might accidentally kill his child on premises! Ah, uh, yikes. Let's try to avoid that, shall we? Well, I'm content! Thanks for helping out with the inspection! Feel free to do whatever you'd like now! The restaurant is your oyster! And by oyster, I mean slightly gone off, a slightly gone off clam that you found in the dumpster behind all the you can eat for four dollars seafood buffet! Ciao, sir! Ah, oh, it's really hard to read phone guys uh, stuff in that voice for some reason. Um, let's leave the hallway and let's go and see Oscar. I think. I wanna go and see Oscar? I think we can anyway. I don't know. Uh, maybe. No, we can't. That's interesting. Okay, let's go into the boys' toilets and then let's just leave then. Uh, oh, the strip club, there we go. That was weird. Wow, this is really fancy. Sedu seductively slide your torso up and down the strip pole. You attempt to slide your body down the strip pole but end up cutting up your torso on the jagged rusted metal. Lord, that thing isn't safe. Might want to make sure that you're up to date with your tennis shots. Search the strip club. $19 was found, but my god, this cash feels slimy. Blech. Lovely. Lovely. Okay, guys. Um. <laughs> It's the Nowhere Man! Do you accept him as part of your restaurant? As a part of your life? Um, sure, why the hell not? I guess he's part of my restaurant now! Nice! What an interesting day, guys. What an interesting day. Thank you for the money. $270. Okay, boys. We are going to have to go and salvage an animatronic, I think. I really hope that a kid doesn't go missing. I'm pretty sure he will. I'm pretty sure he's going to go missing. Hey, phone guy. So, here we are. 6 p.m. Thanks for staying back and helping me with the dastardly health inspector. Bear will live to see another day. Which is obviously a good thing for anyone who isn't a lo local parent, health inspector, police officer, or concerned children's rights activist. Glad to help, sir. Well, your help was much appreciated. Today could have been a total disaster. Imagine what could have happened if the inspector had checked what's under the rug in the back. Oh? What's under the rug in the back, employee? Uh, uh, Trust me, sir, uh, you don't want to know. Uh, By the way, uh, craziness uh, aside, we made $938 in total today, sir. So here's your cut of that. Thanks. Uh, well, uh, sir, uh, that's everything covered, minus my final duties before the place is locked up tight. Uh, uh, You're free to leave now, uh, if you'd like. Um, uh, cool beans. See you next month, employee. I'll see you on the flip side, sir. Okay, what are we gonna go into the RPG style thing now? Today was a strange day. Salvaging Dave turned out to be a mistake. You refused Dave's offer to kidnap a child together. Thanks to your actions, today ran as smoothly as it possibly could. You say goodbye to Phony and cartwheel out with the restaurant. Either way, what's done is done. Tomorrow is another day. There we go, guys. 
That's a more positive ending to the day. What's happening now then? Yep, we're still gonna go salvage an animatronic. Um, we can either salvage Breadbear again. Um, Withered Bonnie or that mouse. Um, oh, let's, shall we salvage the mouse? Let's salvage the mouse, boys. I think that's what I'm going to do. Back in 87. Yep. So let's go and let's get the mouse, guys. We might as well. Um, yeah, let's do it. Let's get the mouse, boys. I've got a bad feeling about it, though. I've got a bad feeling about it. Um, but we're just going to go for it anyway. Uh, I'm pretty sure he was the first one up north. Um, so yeah, let's get Mousy. Should be it should be down this corridor, right? Um, go west and he's there, boys. Was he dangerous last time? I can't. I don't even remember. Let's get him. It's called Far Four. Yep, it's a rat. Salvage him. Yeah, let's go for it. Let's go back. Um, whether that's a good decision or not, because he is old, but all of the animatronics are old. I think the most less dangerous one is actually Bread Bear, to be honest. But I don't think this is going to affect our ending, hopefully. And anyway, it's a different ending, so... It doesn't matter what ending we get. I'm just going with my decisions now. Um, like, I'm trying to get the good ending, but if we get a different one, it doesn't really matter to me. Let's go back, boys. I have what I came for. Uh, very well, what's done is done. You say goodbye for the last time and leave through the window. Tomorrow is another day. I do wonder if we're going to do the um, RPG things again, boys. Where we go into the flip side and speak with uh, Dave. Uh, let's make this a new save, just in case. There we go. Did we get anything different? Bear, surprisingly, not a crack den yet! Yay! Correct, we aren't. We're just registered as a crack den for tax reasons. Ha! <laughs> hey, that's good news, boys. We're doing something good. Hell yeah! Oh, we're back here! I guess the, I don't know what the flip side thing was about then. I don't know. Let's keep upgrading then. Um, everything. Let's go. Because we've got loads of money now, boys. We might as well get stuff. Um, we need a stage. I wonder if we can upgrade the stage again. Oh, let's upgrade it. Hell yeah, that looks nice. Well, that's an improvement, I guess. Can we upgrade it again? Oh my god, we can. We can upgrade it again. <laughs> now it's yellow. What? When your stage is made of solid gold, you know you're overspending. <laughs> Stop judging me, phone head. <laughs> can we upgrade it again? Really? Um, oh, can we talk about who can perform on the stage? Oh, we don't have any robots on stage. Let's put, um... Hmm. Let's put Far Four on the stage. Yay! They should have burned this rat years ago. That looks amazing. Right? He does not. Well, BB's next to him, so... I guess it looks okay. Uh, we're gonna get Doggo again. We're gonna get Doggo and, uh, and Candy Cadet. Just to make it look a bit cuter. Uh, I'm gonna upgrade the office again, guys, and get a Night Guard. Um, because... Because of the security and stuff. I'm gonna hire Sarah. This time. And I'm gonna upgrade the office. Oh, office decor! Um, let's put a decoration on the right. Um, 
An old Freddy uh, poster. Uh, Yay! I wonder if we could upgrade the strip club. Imagine if we can. Oh God! First things first, we need to work. We need someone to work the strip club. Oh, okay. Do we have any takers yet? Um, on the internet, which said, "Pizza place looking for a man to get sweaty in a sexy fox costume." Some guy called Oscar. Yeah. Okay. Um. Let's hire him. Uh oh. Um. Okay. Let's just, yeah. If he does anything wrong, then I'm screwed. I'm screwed. Oh my god, he's actually here, boys. Oscar's over there. If you wish to speak to him. He's already suited up. I honestly can't tell if he's really committed or just wants to be a fox. Hello, Oscar. Hey, your boss. How do I look? You're looking good. Same to you, sir. Hey, he's actually not that bad then. He just seems happy, right? I hope so. Can we upgrade anything? Uh, here we go. We'll upgrade the stripper pole. There we go. And I guess that's a nice stripper pole. As far as stripper poles go, anyway. It's purple. I said something, then I accidentally skipped it. Um, me love wine. Yes, very good. Who the heck put this moron in charge of us? Um, let's buy a salad bar. Really, a salad bar? In a strip club of all places? Make it happen. That's an order. Hey! I wasn't trying to disobey you, I was just didn't quite get your process. There we go. Looking good. I hope you're content now. I am never content. Can I buy another salad bar? Oh my god. If you get if you buy two salad bars, you get sent to a special afterlife. Alright, guess I'll enjoy what I have then. What else can we get? Uh, can we upgrade it again? Okay, now it's all solid gold. Is that pole? Is that made of solid gold? Why are you throwing money around like this? What were you thinking? It's my money, I can waste it if I please. I give this place three days before it gets permanently shut down. Well, I've got no money now, boys. Um, but hey, it's looking good. That's the main thing. That's the main thing. I think we can go. I don't know what's going to happen now, to be honest. One month later. Yeah, so we're back again. Um, The flip side doesn't look like it's going to happen now, does it? Okay, you know the drill, pal. It's time to get back. Check, check on phony. Hopefully it's good news. Hopefully a kid's not missing. Please. What music would you like to play? Anything? Okay, here we go. Hello, hello. Sir, you're back. It's good to see you again. Uh, likewise, employee. Okay, so I'm sure you'd like a rundown how, how, on how things have been going. This place is actually uh, an actual success. That might be a first for Freddy Fest for a Freddy's restaurant. Wait, really? I feel like Freddy's has done some long-lasting successful locations. Yeah, but I mean... Can you think of one location which managed to stay open on its own merits? And not through extensive bribery, destruction of crime scene evidence, and supernatural rituals? Um, Bakersfield, Colorado, Hurricane, Fred Bears. Oh, please. Bakersfield location was open for like a week. Colorado and Hurricane's location were bleached the tiles nightly central. Also, there's been at least four exorcisms performed at Fred Bears. Four. 
That's four times more than our location's had so far. Point taken. So, uh, yeah. Place is doing great, so we might actually be able to save the company. You feel like staying today to help out? Uh, yeah, well, I've traveled all the way here. I might as well. Coolio! That's totally funky, man. I'll just, uh, be running the entire place as per usual. Give me a holler if you need me for anything. See you on the flip side, sir. Okay, guys. I am going to call that today's episode. It's going to be interesting uh, to see what happens next. So I'm going to view the stage and interact with Mouse. Uh, I forgot his name already. Four Swords or something. And we're going to go to the safe room and see if uh, Dave's in there. If, if not, or, or if he is, we'll have a chat. And we'll just see what happens. And I think that will be for the good ending, the next part. So, yeah. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Thank you so much for the support. I really do appreciate it. Lots of love. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you all next time.